Absolutely. All right. And we are live. Thanks a lot. Um, welcome to the July 8 uh, meeting, SMI community meeting. Um, we have um, a couple of folks here. Please add yourself to the meeting notes uh, so that we know who has been around. Um, and um, yeah, thanks for scribing, Bridget. And let's jump into the agenda. First item is blog posts. Uh, is that you, Bridget? Did you want to? It, it is, that? yes. Um, I finally wrote the uh, minimal amount of documentation necessary so that people can submit their blog posts. Um, I know this, the fine folks at Solo and a few other folks are interested in writing, I think maybe Tom and a few others are interested in writing a blog post for the SMI website. So the information you need is right there. And if you want to submit them, uh, we will hopefully get them reviewed and get them out and just build the momentum of people's exciting work that they're doing uh, using SMI on their projects. Cool. Any questions? Is that, does anyone on the call have a question? Everything clear? Cool. Uh, next up, uh, coordinate the SDK release. That's from Stefan, right? Stefan, are you? So I added his name um, because we were discussing it on the uh, Slack, but he isn't able to be on the call today. But what I wanted to do is make sure anyone who wanted to review and perhaps, uh, you know, you know, add to that particular GitHub issue. Basically, Stefan sees that as the one blocker, and I think probably Thomas, Michelle, and a few others have opinions about this. Um, I see Michelle is on the call if Michelle wants to tell us what she thinks. Hey, yeah, um, so I'm going to review this uh, pull request today so we can get a release out. Um, this pull request, though, adds a traffic target. Oh, it adds traffic target V1 alpha 2. I don't know that it bumps us from bumps us with the to get the latest changes on V1 alpha 3. I need to double check on that. Um, so once we've reviewed, we can go ahead and uh, cut that release. I think we need two people to review. So if somebody else is interested. That's so you're saying we were not yet through. We are, we are still like, we need to unblock that, right? We need. We yeah, that's the big. Blocker. Yeah, that's a big blocker. We need people to review. Oh, it looks like we need one approving review to merge the pull request. First of all, we should also change that to two. But if it's just one, then I can do it. Do we have anyone on the call who would fit the bill? Uh, I can ask Thomas off offline. He might be um, good to review that. OK, if you could do that, that would be awesome. Hey, Michelle, I might just create an issue for the 0 0.4 release and tag that PR as a, as a, as a de uh, uh, dependency. So yeah, that'd be would good. that be worth it? Okay, I'll do that and I'll, I'll fix the approve as too. Yeah. So did we also cut a release of the spec at 0.4? Do we need to do that? I think we did. Hang on. I will check. Okay. Uh, not that they need to be coordinated, but it'd be really nice to like make sure that the spec uh, that, that there is a release of this, that a uh, solid release of the spec that's clearly defined. And then the SDK can like make sure that we're at that matching version or we support that particular version, we can point to it. So let's um, do two things today. One, um, I'll definitely go ahead and work with you, Lockheed, to like make sure that the spec version is where we're at and we have the right release tagged. Um, for that, and then I'll also review Stefan's PR so we can make sure we um, cut a release and point to the right version of the spec. Okay, I will add that all to the issue. Looks like it's 0 0.4.0 WD. Yeah, so let's cut our, let's uh, tag a release of the spec first, and then we'll um, cut the release of the SDK. Okay. Cool. 
Any other question or comment regarding that? Thanks a lot uh, for helping out there, Lick. Much appreciated. Cool. Doesn't seem to be the case. Then uh, more like an FYI, unless someone uh, feels uh, like they want to discuss something. You might have seen the, the news a couple of hours ago that uh, Istio found a home. There is a new foundation um, called Open Usage Commons, I believe. And it looks like Istio is, um, is part of that together with two other projects. Um, I have not yet fully understood the implications, what it means in terms of, you know, um, relation. I, I, I'm unsure if if that is a Linux foundation. Foundation, I don't it, believe it is. So. It okay. is not. It is not. Okay, thanks for. Yeah, hi, this is Josh here. The um, hey, Josh. Um, so, um, yeah, it's not. It's not Linux Foundation. It's an independent mm -hmm. foundation run by Google staff and some researchers <clears throat> at this point. Um, and apparently all it does is trademark licensing. So it is probably not a substantial change to how Istio the project is run. Right. And, and does anyone think that in terms of, you know, the cooperation or, or integration or whatever um, of Istio in, in SMI uh, that, that yeah. anything on a technical level, operation level changes or like fast it's probably- The, the only issue. thing that I can think of is we currently had not put the Istio logo on anything. And if logo governance is different now, we should maybe look into that because if the open source nature of this foundation means that the logo can be used in this usage, then perhaps it's fine. But that I don't, I'm not, I am not a lawyer. Amy's a lawyer. Maybe Amy can look into it. I don't know. <laughs> nope, fully no. No, 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 no. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I to heard be fair, we create an issue and there. assign it to Amy, right? That's what no, I heard. Uh, we create an issue and assign no, it to Amy, right? I, I think you're going to have to wait for them to get their stuff together because they totally um, have, I mean, like the point of their organization is trademark licensing. But that said, they don't actually have a procedure for trademark licensing set up yet. So you're probably going to have to actually wait for them to publish something that says submit your request here. See chat. Um, yeah, it says we just need to look okay. at the, there are no immediate changes to the Istio usage guidelines and the open usage commons will respect existing Istio trademark licenses and permission to use the Istio name. So we have to we look don't at the have. usage guidelines. We I mean, don't we have don't, permission. I don't think we and have. I, I'm, so maybe I'm, it changes yeah. nothing. That's really the only thing I could think of. I will put this that you put it from the fact in the notes, Lackey. I'm just being as thorough as I can. I don't think there's anything else that affects us. Is there anything else anyone else sees that might affect this project? Yeah, I think it's um, positive for the project. Okay. Cool. Oh, and um, by the way, sorry, po positive for SMI, I mean, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> I'm, I'm, yeah. <laughs> it's a helpful. It's a helpful. Thing. And I, I interpreted it that way. Yes. Um, <laughs> cool. Um, all right. Uh, next on the agenda is welcome, John, to the SMI community. Michelle, take it away. Hey, yeah. Uh, John is on my team. Um, so, John, if you want to introduce yourself, feel free. Um, uh, John is working on metrics-related things uh, and is hopefully going to make the SMI metrics. Um, part of the spec uh, a little bit better and uh, a little bit more up to date. So feel free to intro yourself, John. All right. Hi, everyone. My name is John Hewn. I just joined Microsoft a little over a month ago uh, working on SMI. So excited to get going. Nice. Welcome, John. Welcome. Welcome aboard. Great to have you. All right. Um, I think that was it. That was at least what I see on the agenda. So the door is, or the floor, not the door, <laughs> the floor is open. Any other business, any other items? 
anything you want to raise doesn't seem to be a case going once going twice looks like uh, a short meeting today bridget <laughs> all right <laughs> thanks a lot everyone um and we meet in two weeks time again cheers thank you thanks folks bye now bye.